Welcome back to the channel, QB Passport Flexin. Arriving to Guayaquil Bus Terminal on the way to beautiful Salinas, Ecuador. Walking here to the bus terminal is fairly easy. Getting off of the Uber. This terminal is large, similar to an airport, and you have buses that run throughout all of the country of Ecuador that will take you to any beach, such as Salinas, Montanilla. You can even take a bus ride all the way to Quinto, Ecuador. So the fare was about $13. They have buses that run every hour to Salinas. The level was the third floor and I was able to get a seat close to the window. Very comfortable, my own aisle. I'm a big guy, so it's great. I didn't have to sit next to anyone. They also have snacks, drinks available. They're very comfortable, but AC. And I was able to relax and ride away. After arriving to Salinas, I was able to hop on a taxi via InDriver, which is an app used in Ecuador. All right, I am out here in beautiful Salinas, Ecuador. The sun is out, the ocean is calm. This place looks beautiful, definitely warm. Um, yeah, this is one of the main beaches out here in Ecuador. I'm going to show you a couple of highlights. Some good food, some good seafood, probably some good drinks. Hang out, chill for the day. shop I saw walking by cool designs I just wanted to get a lineup and they got me right for three dollars I love haircuts at a convenient price in all of Latin America If you come to Salinas, 
You must rent a jet ski. They're very convenient on the price between 30 minutes to an hour. It's very inexpensive and you get to view the whole entire town of Salinas. Beautiful, nice coastline and just grooving on the waves. After hitting the waves, your boy had an appetite, went to Restaurante Mar y Terra, which is a seafood place here in Salinas. Very awesome. I am a seafood fanatic, and Ecuador has some of the best seafood of all of Latin America. The lobster was huge, nice proportion, king size, had some vegetables on the side with a sparkling water, and it was delicious. All right, I'm at one of Salinas' iconic beach, La Chocolatera. This is a very nice reserved beach area. I think it's like a federal state type of park. And I want to definitely explore it for you guys. Show you a map. It's beautiful out here. Very calm. It's a great day. Not a whole lot of people out here, which is good. The beach is open seven days a week. However, the hours are limited, so you might want to check on the website if you come down to Salinas. The waves are beautiful. If you go deep enough, you will see whales, sharks, turtles, and other sea animals. There are a few vendors there as well if you want a snack or a drink, but the scenery is amazing, nice, romantic, very peaceful, and there's also a few lighthouses you can go check out. Appreciate you guys watching the video all the way to the end hit the sub give this video a like and if you're ever in Guayaquil go check out Salinas you can take a date out there or 
just go out there solo on the weekend and catch a vibe. It is your boy, QB Passport Flex, and signing off.